Welcome to the lab. I'm sure you're excited to get started doing some cool science stuff, and you should be, because this is science class. This is not math, or it's all theoretical, or, or um, abstract, and it's not English, or it's completely made up. This is actual science, where we do cool things. But there's a few things you need to learn to do before you can step foot in a lab like this. Listen, guys, no, seriously, listen. There's some real dangers in this lab. If you don't pay attention, if you don't do what you're supposed to, you're not gonna be able to do this, all right? So listen, lab is a privilege. It is not a right. You don't have to do the lab. If the teacher can't trust you with lab work, then you will not be allowed to do it. They're gonna give you an alternative assignment or be asked to leave entirely. And I promise you that alternative assignment isn't gonna be near as fun as what everyone else is gonna be doing. So please, as I said before, listen. The first thing you can do is make sure you are prepared for the lab. I'm sure the instructor or the teacher is gonna give you some material to look through before you get there. So make sure you read through it, make sure you know all the rules, you know all the regulations, you know all the dangers, you know all the things you have to do. Sometimes the teacher might ask you to bring stuff in, so make sure you double check that. Uh, make sure you're wearing the proper equipment, which we'll talk about later, but just make sure that you are as prepared as possible before you step into this lab. Here are three letters you're gonna hear in a uh, workplace, an industrial workplace, or in the lab at some point in your life. And those three letters are PPE, which stands for Personal Protective Equipment. Uh, PPE can be a lot of things. It can be like a lab coat or um, a helmet or um, eyewear, but either way, whatever it is, you have to wear it. Um, in the classroom, if you don't wear it, you could be docked points or you could be asked not to do the lab. And if you don't wear it at a job, you could be fired. This is stuff meant to protect you and really protect uh, the people around you from personal injury. So please, if you're ever asked to wear PPE, please make sure you do so.